in this lesson we will uh, cover filters we will do several videos of uh, filter how to do multiple uh, uh, parameters of filtering so we'll begin with the create blank app app underscore multi i'm going to name just name it as multi filter step one create now we will use our long list which has uh, id title name prefix first name middle name last name created city publish date publish date number so these are the fields we will add the data source we'll use the connector sharepoint we'll select the long list Then we will insert oh, we can pick from vertical gallery. Ah, the next. Okay. We will use this gallery rank vertical. In the beginning, let's leave some space at the top. In the beginning, we will say items as long list. Now we'll click here, we'll insert a text label. Let's make this smaller. Text label we move up here. We make a copy of this and paste it how many times I don't know. We need five of them. Label one, label two, label three, oh three more beyond two. Let's leave some spaces. Another one. Okay, label one, we will put the ID. In label two, We will put the first name in label three. We will put the last name we'll put the city. And the last name, the published date. Publish, no E. Okay, so we have all in this place. So we will introduce our first filter. We will insert a label. First name. We'll insert a text input and we'll insert a button. Oh, we don't need button. So now in the search, uh, now in the items property, we will put this code, the fetch code. So here, what I'm doing is I'm doing a filter on this long list data source starts with first name text input one dot text and title it is descending by the 
title. We can name it as Boris. This uh, ascending. Okay, so we'll put this sorted by the first name. So we have already covered starts with. So let's see if we run this. Take. We must remove this because there is no name which starts with text input one. So let's take ASA. Then let's take another name and also see it's ordering them by. Let's take my L U T L U T H L R U T. So this is the first filtering based on the first name, and we will add more filtering in our future further videos. So once again, I'll recap. We have the gallery. We have a text input. This gallery we are filtering based on the text input once text we are as we are putting we're showing the result in the first name ascending we can add uh, a button of ascending descending I'm not sure if we can add from here let me try and add sort we can create a variable but I'm, I will not demonstrate, you know, we can create a variable uh, of, uh, you know, the order of uh, ascending, descending, we can uh, do that, but uh, maybe uh, I will show that in the next video. We have already covered that in the previous videos, so you can use uh, the that also, but that's not our purpose of this video is to show filtering. 